Alright, so what's going on guys? In today's video, I want to talk about my top 5 most anticipated games for 2015. And I know it's kind of early to be making a video like this considering that the new year literally just started about a week ago. About a week ago, a week ago. Fuck with us and then we tweak it God damn it, that keeps happening. But anyways, I figured I'd make this video because I don't care. These are the games that I know that I'm ready for and I figured, you know, why not share them with you guys? So we're going to start off with number one. The number one game on the list is, you guys, I'm pretty sure you already know. I mean, you know, right? You do? Okay, well, I guess I'll just say it anyway, but Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain. That game I am so excited for. I'm not even going to go in detail about why because you guys already know that. I'm tired of beating you guys to death with it. So Metal Gear Solid V is number one. Number two on the list is Star Wars Battlefront for next gen. And before I get into this, I just want to say that the same engine that was used for Battlefield 4 is being used for this game. And it is, I'm assuming this game is going to look phenomenal. The only reason why I say I'm assuming is because there are no trailers for it. All we, all we know that the game has been officially announced to come out this year. And we've seen other things, like little small minor things about the game. But I'm assuming the game's going to be great. Why am I assuming the game's going to be great? Well, let's look at their track record. Star Wars Battlefront 1 for the PS2. Star Wars Battlefront 2 for the Xbox and PS2. Those games right there were awesome. Amazing. If you're a Star Wars fan and you're a gamer... Nine times out of ten, you've already played that game. And if you have a PC, I recommend buying it on PC because that game is just that good. Number three on the list is Batman Arkham Knight. Now, why Batman Arkham Knight? That game, I'm pretty, you know, I've seen trailers, I've seen here, you know, I've seen stuff here and there, but I do believe this game is going to be amazing for the simple fact that the original creators that made Batman Arkham Asylum and Batman Arkham City are now making Arkham Knight. The same de development team did not make Arkham Origins, that's why the game, you know, I'm not going to say it was bad, but that's why the game wasn't as good as the other ones. But now we have the same developers making this game, and I believe it is going to be fantastic. I'm a huge Batman fan. I love fighting games like that, and I just, God, I can't wait. And it's supposed to be like an RPG type of game, too, so I'm really just pumped for that. Number four on the list is Bloodborne. Now, you're probably wondering, you know, I've heard about this game, it's exclusive to PS4, why is it supposed to be so good, you know, this and that. And the reason why Bloodborne is just so crazy is because it's basically Dark Souls, but with guns. That's ultimately what this game is, and I, I personally like Dark Souls. I didn't like it at first, but I do like Dark Souls. I think it's a really challenging game, and really frustrating too, really frustrating. Yeah, if you haven't played it, I recommend it. It's really good, frustrating. But you have, to, you have to know, you have to take your time. It's a trial and error type thing, you know? So Bloodborne is definitely on the list. Cannot wait for that game to come out. Oh, man, it's going to be great. And number five on the list is Uncharted 4. Now, this is a game that the only reason why I'm excited for it, because I'm excited to be in a new, I'm excited to play a new game. I'm excited to actually jump into something that's different. Because for those of you who don't know, I've never played Uncharted before. Never played it. Um, let me know in the comments below if you have and if you recommend me playing 1 through 3 before playing this, but this is a completely new game and I feel like it's going to be good because I've heard nothing but good things about Uncharted. So, And plus, uh, it's made by Naughty Dog, I believe, so that's another reason and Naughty Dog, they just have a good, they have a good record going for them right now. So I'm pretty excited about that. Um, I think it's going to be pretty good, but I'm excited because it's a new game and it's like one of those things where it's new, but you know it's going to be good. You know, it's like when uh, Taken first came out or um, you guys probably don't like that, but like Paranormal Activity, that the first one, you know, it's new. You don't know much about it, except, you know, I guess like the theme of the movie of the movie, but you're going into it not knowing. But, you know, it's going to be something interesting, something possibly good and also something new. So there you have it, guys. Those are my top five most anticipated games for 2015. Let me know in the comments below what you're excited for this year, what you're going to play, what you're most hyped about. And yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And peace.